वेलकम बैक टू बिट फ्यूम्स इन दिस एपिसोड वी आर गोइंग टू सेव द प्रोडक्ट इन आर डेटाबेस दैट मींस द कंज्यूमर ऑफ योर एपीआई कैन क्रिएट न्यू प्रोडक्ट ऑन योर डेटाबेस ऑल दीस थिंग्स इन दिस एपिसोड सो विद दैट आई एम योर होस्ट सार्थक एंड दिस इज द चैनल वेयर आई टॉक अबाउट लारवेल एंड द कूल थिंग अबाउट लारवेल सो इफ यू आर न्यू टू दिस चैनल डोंट फॉरगेट टू सब्सक्राइब एंड लाइक बिट फ्यूम्स ऑन फेसबुक ट्विटर एंड इंस्टाग्राम सो लेट्स सी हाउ वी कैन डू दैट we don't know what will be the route so for that let's just go to terminal let's go to terminal here we have and let's say php artisan route colon list we have many routes because we also have the passport route but we are interested in this api slash products with a post request so this is a post request but we have to remember that this creation of product that means to create a product it has to be authenticated so firstly one important thing we have to do we have to provide the middleware for that post route only that means for this post route we need authentication we need to delete any product we need authentication similarly to update any product we need authentication so for that i will open my product controller product controller here firstly i will create a new constructor so cons construct and here i will say dollar this arrow middleware and name of middleware is auth colon api and one important thing is that we don't want this to be on index and not on show so we have to say accept index and show okay so this is the way we can protect this routes okay so let's go here and if i say localhost colon 8000 api slash products make a post request we don't provide any kind of authentication send this route and then you can see we have this kind of something called error so let's say here content type will be json okay let's say accept one also accept json and now you can see message is unauthenticated but if i say authorize and here give auth so it will be like this one now if i send this nothing because in our store method we have done nothing so let's just return something okay send this route and yes this means our authentication is working if i uncheck this unauthenticated great good deal but we need to have the validations for this so if i don't provide any kind of product details we have to say that we need like these fields so let's create a new request so go to terminal and here i will say php artisan let's just maximize uh, php artisan make request and request name is product request okay hit enter and let's go to app http and then requests we have re product request so let's first do this true authorize is true if authorize then go here then we need the product name to be required so required then obviously product detail required similarly we have many things like price we have then we have the stock then we have what we have discount also so discount and i think that's it let's just verify on product name detail price stock discount that's nice so everything is required but here is the main point this name has to be unique 
so i will say unique for product table then this discount has to be max of 2 similarly a stock can be max of let's say 6 okay and price has to be max of let's say 10 okay so all these things are good to go and one thing more let's give here max of 255 for the name and everything is good so let's go to postman send this and we are not getting anything because we have to use that request on our controller so instead of only request i will say product request and import it at the top you can see it is here and now because we are using this request if i go send this we have these error field the name field is required detail field is required everything is required required so why not provide all these data so i will go to raw provide firstly the name name is uh, everyone's favorite <laughs> iphone x okay then description that has to be inside double quotes description because your uh, consumer will know it as a description not the detail so if you get this show product what we are getting we are getting description but in our database we have detail so your consumer will know that it's a description not detail how will the consumer know what name you have given on database he always know whatever he get according to that he will provide so description is here and description we will provide as let's say the best ever phone with face id okay great <laughs> then the price i don't know what the price they have set but i will call it only 400 dollars <laughs> then price then stock stock has to be i will say 10 iphone x i have i wish <laughs> i have this <laughs> and then discount i will provide because this is up to me i will provide 50 percent discount and everything is set up let's just go to sublime go to product request and this time instead of detail i will say description okay because we have made it description okay now we want to save data so i will go to store function i will just say return request arrow all so we will see what we are sending now send this yeah we are getting everything so let's just get product dollar product is equal to product and this has to be new so new product and x use small p and we also have product at the top that's very nice now let's save each and everything so product arrow name will be equal to request arrow name that's nice but we know that our detail is given by description okay similarly here comes uh, uh, stock so here also will be stock and now comes price so i have used this control d to select and once more to select the next occurrence so then comes discount and finally after that and that's not has to be comma why i have given comma let's delete also yeah and now comes product arrow save and if i save this that's okay but obviously we have to response with something that it's created or response something else so let's just say response and inside of response i'm going to give these things inside the data so data will be equal to same product which is just created but this has to be transformed so new product resource 
and after that let's say 201 for created let's go to postman and let's provide the data which is like name will be ah uh, yeah iphone x everyone's favorite let's make it in capitals then description description has to be like best new phone with face id great then we need a stock i say stock will be x8 10 <laughs> i don't have this i wish i have this 10 amount of iphones but price because it's my hand price i will say only 150 dollars then i will give discount also <laughs> so discount will be uh, i will get 50 percent yay 50 percent discount so this is okay and you can see this error is good we are giving this header authorization that's everything is good let's send this and you can see we are getting all these things with this review and obviously there is no review yet because it's just created so rating no rating yet so this is very nice and you can see 201 is created if i go to my database reload database you can see at the bottom iphone x is here <laughs> iphone x data is here i wish iphone x is here okay then what we have to do one thing is important that we are hard coding this 201 but but laravel has a great response list so if you go to vendor symphony http foundation response you will get a list of all the responses you can possibly have but i want this http created so let's use instead of that i will say response colon colon http created and obviously we have to import this at the top so we have to import one vendor symphony http foundation response this one okay great so let's create one more and this time iphone 8 that's great let's say and this one not having face id with uh, wireless charger wireless charging great and price has to be come yeah low yeah good send this and this time also 201 created and all these things and everything is set up so we have completed this part and let's just save this on our list so product it should be product uh, create created no, not that create only okay then here api save to products yeah product create and we have created that so if you go show product having id of which one id is that 103 so 103 hit send we will get the details so we will meet in the next episode to get some new thing till then don't forget to subscribe like bit fumes on facebook twitter and instagram so we will meet in the next episode till then goodbye